So I'm here in Petra, which is part of the land of the biblical Edomites, the sons of Esau. And if you remember, Esau was also called Edom, um, and it means red because he was a redhead. Interestingly, Petra is also full of these beautiful red rock formations. Uh, the Nabataeans ruled here uh, for hundreds of years and they built these uh, great big tombs and um, it's a beautiful place, amazing to explore, but um, it just brought a deeper meaning to me to see what this land is like of when Obadiah is prophesying against the Edomites because when, when Judah went into exile in 586 BC, the Edomites, who were also um, were sons of Esau, and so um, related, um, distantly, but still related to the Jews. Um, they didn't help them. They weren't even grieving for them or with them. They were actually kind of rejoicing and jeering. And so the book of Obadiah is a prophecy against Edom saying, uh, because of your pride, because you didn't grieve or help your brothers, because you jeered at them and celebrated them going into exile, you too will be destroyed. And it talks about how um, you take comfort in your rocks, in your hiding places in the rocks. Um, but those aren't going to protect you when the time of destruction comes. And those verses just mean a lot more being here and seeing these rocky area and the places where they could have hid it, hidden and uh, all the strength that they had in these hiding places in the rocks. Just a beautiful place though.